Yo, new update just dropped. And before I start, make sure to redo my code. I'm gonna put it in the description. It's also on screen. It gives uh, one luck, three plot, and uh, one speed three plot. But in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys like a bunch of squads that can help you beat Muzon. Muzon is actually surprisingly uh, really easy, like compared to Boros. If you can beat Boros, you can beat Muzon. So uh, for all these, I'm just gonna use four eyes since it's just the easiest thing. But this squad right here, as you can see, just beat him. And it's really, like, really, really easy. You literally just need something to stun. So Rukia is probably the best for this. And you just need some decently high DPS. I'm pretty sure this also beats him. Okay, I lied, but... um, Yeah, you really just need something to stun. And then you just need something to... Um, oh, I didn't even do that. But you just need something to deal decent damage. So, you see, uh, Silver Enigma does 2.1k. Bam does, I think, after nerf, like, what, like... 1.2k now but if you have um like for example a sasuke sasuke is really really strong in this boss because you can just put sasuke first and then like for example if this is my sasuke put three scarlet nobles or anything that stuns and you will end up killing him uh let me see something i don't know if foreign cubes beat him but i'm gonna see they might ah this is another squad that beats him but yeah if you guys have like a team that beats boros you definitely have a team that beats muzan because I'm pretty sure Boris is directly harder. Um, I don't know if Shikamaru is worth using. I know a lot of people started using Shikamaru after they added support cards to beat Boros, but I don't know if it's worth. Uh, anyways, yeah, if you can beat Boros, you could beat Muzan. He's really easy, and you can just get that free 1.5x um, battle speed. That's it, though. Remember to use my code. Remember, like, and subscribe. Peace out.